Hey, what is going on guys? Charlotte Valentini here and welcome back to where we take awesome out of the box. Now, it's been a while since my last smartwatch review, so here we are with the Huawei Watch GT2 Pro. Alright, so before we get started, let's quickly unbox the Huawei Watch GT2 Pro. So that's a very premium looking box. Black and gold. So let's open her up. And there she is. Right away you get the watch. But we will take a look at that later. For now, let's open this up. And we get symbols for the USB cable and the documentation. So we know what's in here. You get the instruction manual as well as the warranty card. So it's very important that you keep this just in case something happens to the watch. We also have a USB Type-C cable. And last but definitely not the least, one of the selling points for this watch, the wireless charger. So it's a magnetic wireless charger. So we're very happy Huawei decided to go for this. It's going to make things a lot more convenient for those who don't really like plugging in their smartwatches. So let's take a look at what that looks like with the cable connected. Now, of course, we look at the watch. And it's so clean. Look at that. Nice build, looks really premium, looks very smart. We have two buttons here which we will get to in the video as well as a nice silicone strap. Feels very durable, feels very premium, especially the watch face right here. We also have a set of improved sensors which we will get to in the main video. Now let's take a look at what the wireless charging is going to look like. Just like that. Snaps right in because of the magnets very loose so it doesn't feel like it's gripping onto the watch too tight anyway that's the unboxing stick around for the rest of the video and the rest of this watch's features for the pros we have a titanium body sapphire glass protection wireless charging and long battery life for the cons you can't install third-party apps and you can't use third-party services like Strava Huawei strengthens its wearables portfolio in the Philippines by bringing over its new flagship smartwatch, the Watch GT2 Pro. Announced last September, the Watch GT2 Pro is an upscale version of the Watch GT2, where you get an overall better build, with sapphire crystal glass which will be a huge help protecting against scratches, titanium frame, and ceramic case back with sapphire glass to protect its array of sensors. Put simply, it is built to last, it is very durable, and uses high quality materials. Classy does not always mean fragile, I mean just look at James Bond. For the display, you get a 1.39 inch AMOLED touchscreen display. This is 454 pixels and sports 326 ppi. The watch measures in at around 47 millimeters, which is substantial. While it certainly looks good on my wrist, Ladies may not like it as much because of how big it looks on theirs. The display is very sharp which helps add to the already effective illusion that it is a classic analog watch. It is also aesthetically versatile with over 200 watch faces to choose from. That is a lot of options. Thanks to the look and design of its physical buttons, the watch on its own is clearly for a more formal look. You could wear it to work or when you have business meetings or even when you have some formal events. Thanks to the wide variety of watch faces available, you are not limited to just that. The silicon strap, in fact, makes it perfect for sports or exercise. I tried this watch out during one of my Sparta sessions and I was very, very happy with its performance. It was not intrusive at all and the features worked great. What I'm trying to say is it's basically an all-around watch, good for all occasions and activities. Like any good smartwatch, it can also display notifications as well as make voice calls thanks to its Bluetooth capabilities. More on the updates from the original GT2, the Watch GT2 Pro has a more accurate heart sensor, sleep tracking, and now features SpO2 or a blood oxygen sensor, which is pretty cool because it tells you how much oxygen you have present in your blood. These functions will be very, very useful, especially to those who have health conditions and need to track those stats. We also have tracking for over 100 workout modes and pro-grade fitness tracking features, which can be tracked through the Huawei Health app found on any Huawei smartphone. If you don't own a Huawei smartphone, it's nice of them to make it available for both Android and Apple. You can also upload health data to three key services, 
Google Fit, My Fitness Pal, and Apple Health. Unfortunately, there is no connectivity for services like Strava. More serious swimmers will appreciate the watch's 5ATM waterproofing, as well as its indoor and outdoor swim tracking capabilities. Pair this with its very accurate GPS tracking and you have a watch that you can use for triathlons. Like Huawei's other smartwatches, the watch GT2 Pro uses the company's Lite OS that does come armed with 32MB of RAM and 4GB of storage. It uses the company's Kirin A1 processor to keep things chugging along. The downside to Lite OS is that you can't really download any apps that aren't already available in the watch itself. That being said, LightOS already covers a lot of apps you'd want on a smartwatch. It also has tracking and workouts for a lot of activities and exercises out of the box already. LightOS is well light on resources, which is why the watch has such great battery life. Speaking of battery, we now have wireless charging on the watch, which means if you have a phone that supports reverse wireless charging or have a wireless charging pad, you'll be very happy with this feature. It's just overall more convenient, and we're very happy that Huawei decided to add some quality of life improvements. Aside from supporting wireless charging, the Watch GT2 Pro's quick charge feature lets you have 10 hours of battery life with just 5 minutes of charging. On top of that, we have Huawei's acclaimed 14-day battery life. Realistically though, you'll probably be getting 5-7 to seven days of battery life on a single charge. Less if you use the Always On feature. That still leagues beyond what the competitors have to offer which makes the watch perfect for anyone who doesn't want to fiddle with charging their watch every day. There you have it, Huawei's smartwatch offering has always been easy to recommend to people. And that's still true with their watch GT2 Pro. It looks incredibly handsome in its titanium and sapphire body. While its light OS is constraining in terms of third-party compatibility, it has more than enough built-in apps and tracking capabilities to satisfy most users. Christmas is right around the corner, and if you want to give yourself a treat or want to gift someone special, the Huawei Watch GT2 Pro is an excellent option. It is priced at 11,990 pesos and is available today at Lazada and the Huawei online store. Don't forget to check out the full review on Unbox.ph and also don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed that video. Hit the notification icon if you want to get them updates when we drop them videos. Once again, I am Chalo Talentino and I'll see you guys in the next one.